Because it is highly resistant to extreme temperatures, asbestos was a very convenient material to include in the insulation of stoves and fireplaces before 1980s. It was finally regulated in construction products after. While it was originally employed to make the home safer, asbestos insulation becomes more and more friable over the years, which inevitably leads to toxic fibers being released in the air when the material is disturbed. The exhaust pipes of fireplaces would be insulated with asbestos during the last century. In chimneys, transite asbestos may be present, which is a brand of insulation made with cement mixed with 10 to 50% asbestos. It is usually found in chimney flues, both in commercial and residential buildings. The main purpose of the flue lining is to withstand extreme temperatures and to prevent the heat from escaping. Another place where you may find asbestos insulation is in wood-burning stoves. In addition to ducts, asbestos may also be present in the components of the stove itself. It may also lurk in the insulating material around it. A wood-burning stove may have a millboard, cement sheet, or asbestos paper and tape for insulation and fireproofing, which are other sources of potential asbestos exposure. Asbestos may be present in the door gasket of your stove as well. If you are thinking of remodeling your house by replacing your stove or fireplace, you should first hire a team of specialists who will safely remove the asbestos from these products. After asbestos is no longer present in your stove, chimney, or fireplace, the products can be replaced with new ones without the risk of asbestos exposure. If you are uncertain whether your stove, chimney, or fireplace has asbestos, you can send a sample of the insulation to a lab for analysis. If your house was built before 1980s, most likely it has asbestos. If you are remodeling, you should proceed with caution. Disturbing the insulation found on stoves, fireplaces, or chimneys may result in asbestos exposure as well as contamination of your entire house.